Hello everyone, and welcome back to an another episode of Let's Play Ark the Lad Twilight of the Spirits with me as your host, Ultra Gamer J. In this episode, we begin the hunt for the elusive Lilia, whose name I had completely forgotten in the very last episode. time we get to see the village of Yuval like this at night. I mean, it looks really nice. hope that music was by by an idol group we have here? First, let's check in this house that we're obviously not going to be able to go into. Thank you. 
You don't have to worry about getting gel. Saying, Paulette, you have nothing to be jealous about. Unless Lilia ends up being a party member, you have nothing to worry about when it comes to getting a rival for Kark's affections. He said, having a very hazy memory of as to whether or not of another female party member would be joining them. I'm gonna end up having to put my foot in my mouth soon, aren't I? If not soon, then at some point. I mean, the girl couldn't... I mean, Lilia couldn't... couldn't even hold herself in, a, in that fight, so... What was there to be jealous? What was there to be work? She has no com combat capability, so... You've got nothing to worry about how, when it comes to her joining. Probably. an interesting story that we would not have learned otherwise because that was the plot point of one of the one of the three games or three Ark the Lad games that came out before Twilight of the Spirits. Oh, that's just a repeat of what he said previously. Thought he had a different yarn to spin. Yeah. As I s stated in a previous video, this is not the first installment in a franchise. This is the 
second to last. We did not get the first three installments of this series because raisins. Zev, that's not very nice. The proprietress has a life, too. Kind of. Not exactly. She's an NPC, so she... She's not alive in the ways that matter. She's just a passenger on this story train. blissfully unaware that she is just another character in this elaborate theatrical production that we call a video game. Huh. I guess Maru doesn't sleep here. There she is! I wonder if Marv's sitting in that one part of the room. I don't know why, but he strikes me as the kind of individual that would do that sort of thing. Oh, dang it.
Um, since they haven't been revealed, revealed, or we haven't gone in depth to them, at least in on this side of the story, let's go with no.
I saw you there, Paulette. Gargan Lilia might not have, but I certainly did. And again, unless another female party member appears to join Karg's party, you've got nothing to worry about when it comes to competition. And unfortunately, I do not have any wood to knock on. So I guess I'm, at, at some point through this let's play, I'm gonna have to put my foot in my mouth. Which I can do, literally. I mean, it's not as glamorous as a backflip by Crank Gameplays, but it's, it's something. Let's not on the bridge anymore. it was the same story again. And this is my punishment for getting my hopes up. Can't say I don't deserve this. Yeah, if it was a sad song that Lilia was playing, she could have, liked played that one song by by Muse from Love Live that was featured in, like, a really short OVA. I forget the name, but we got to see Maki Nishikino as a little girl, and she was adorable. 
kind I wish I could have as a dateru. Or daughter for non weebs. May God be with you. I think I'm gonna stop the video here. Since we are well past the 25 minute mark. This has been Ultra Gamer J signing off, hoping to see you all in the next video, and please remember to like and subscribe for more content.